Let's talk about the weekend, which is finally here, which means a lot of sports to look forward Ooh. to. And what can we look forward to? Well, let's start off first uh, with the fact that the Proteas are on a good run right now. That first test match in Cape Town against India went very, very much in our favour. We're loving the way yeah, it's looking. Yeah, but we were also pushed. We were test. Sadly, Dale Stain, after making his great big comeback, is out again with injury. So we certainly commiserate with him. But um, a test against India is always great when you've got number one players, number two in the world rankings, even better. When you've got our fast bowlers firing on all cylinders, absolutely amazing. Big Vern, nine wickets. Goodness, um, look at that. Ends. What a sight. This is his home ground. He was on fire. Um, and I would imagine that the, the groundskeepers in Centurion ahead of this test, they're going to go for a similar track. They want it to be fast. They want to give something for the bowlers. So the batsmen, again, are going to be under yeah. huge amounts of pressure. A.B. de Villiers back with a bang. The most runs scored um, over both innings. I think just over 100 runs there. Uh, Kakiso Rabada, of course, his five for getting him back on the top of the world test ranking. So it's going to be a massive tussle. Don't expect the Indians to roll over. They have got such firepower in that batting lineup. Yeah, I'm sure they, Virat is firing back. the boys oh, up in the change um, room. And they're a very psychologically based team. I know once they get it right, they are going to be an unstoppable force. So yeah. expect fireworks at Centurion tomorrow, man. Absolutely. Now, alongside making a massive announcement about her uh, most recent pregnancy, Joanne Strauss is also out at Sun City emceeing the South African op uh, Open, while well, the, uh, the opening ceremonies there are. Yeah. But it's all happening there uh, in the golfing world. Um, it really is. The SA Open, believe it or not, it's the second second oldest golfing tournament in the world. Bro. What? It kicked off in 1903. So a lot it? of tradition there. And of course, the small <coughs> matter of 15 million rand on offer. <laughs> um, so it's a massive prize post. It's brought out some of the biggest golfers in the world. When we look at last year, Graham Storm obviously took it with uh, Roy McIlroy coming in second place. Um, but so far, so good for Brandon Grace. He's out there on top after day one with American Chase Kupka. Um, they shot to opening rounds of 65. Great way to start both seven under. Um, Chris Paisley in third at 66 with a six under. Um, so go out and support um, of course, a fantastic golf course there as well at Glendower Golf Club in Johannesburg. It's a beautiful place to take in a round. Yeah, and a quick wrap-up of what you can expect in the soccer world this coming weekend. Orlando Pirates will be taking on Mamelodi Sundowns in the English Premier League. Manchester City up against Liverpool at That's a big one. Liverpool. That's a massive, big one. And in uh, Pro 14, Southern Kings uh, versus the Cheetahs. Maybe one of them will get the well, win. they'll get a win this year. It's amazing. <laughs> we're still watching rugby, man. I mean, we've got to love the fact that we've got Northern Hemisphere. But all the best of luck to the Proteas. Show some Proteas fire. Get out to Centurion and support Fuff and the Boys. Thanks.